<clears throat> I'm just sitting here eating pizza and everyone in the lobby already knows I won the game. And then let me show you my pizza. The reason it looks mid is because it, it's like a week old. It was just sitting in the fridge. I actually just found it when I was scavenging the kitchen. The plate wasn't even fully dried, so the bottom of the the crust is like slight soggy. I didn't even microwave it long enough. The middle is still cold, while the crust is not. It's all good. Wait, that's real. It's because uh, I mean, items. Uh, this game is all about items. It doesn't matter if you have Kaisa two, Yasuo two, whatever, everything too. If you don't have items for them, you're they don't do anything. Items make units like six times stronger than they are. The unit themselves without items doesn't do shit. And Ezra just gives you uh, items. So why not TF? It gives the TF gives less items. Also, TF's further augments suck. Whereas Ezra's are actually good. It gives less items. You you can you can choose your items. Yeah, but the thing is, or you can just not suck. And just fucking and play the comp that you you have items for. Like with the buff to tier, the buff to ice cream cone, it like makes AP good, which also buffs cloak because you can go spark. So like the worst items before, like before it was an AD meta with like bow BF dominating, but now like tier cloak rod are all good. So no matter what, you you can't even low roll. Like I mean, how the fuck can you low roll? Fuck it, I'm going KO three. Maybe Kale maybe is broken. I mean, I have four Kales. Maybe I just hit a Kale 3 for free. And it's a forced. Every third attack launches a wave that deals 44 magic damage and 40% shreds. Yeah, that's not bad. I didn't get a bow though. Fuck it. Pandora's bench, KO3. Oh, I don't even know which one's better. These are all fucking bis. Okay, don't I have snap shots coming up? Snap shots coming up? Yep, I do. <clears throat> Let me actually play the fucking game. But Kale Rural sounds kind of fun. Vertical lines going to six Ionia, six Challenger sometimes. What is your so uh, when someone dies, you you steal their items, or the entire lobby steals their items, so you don't actually steal their items. What is Kale's base eighty thirty eight? What? How can I- what the fuck is KL1's base? Oh no, I know, but I know, I'm trying to- I'm trying to find the Zeke's holder, because Zeke's is 25% AD. 
And like you, I mean, I'm not putting it on 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 Kale. It, it, it's like what? I have a worth making this on. I have a rod. Zeke's rod, Sunfire. Oriana, Talia, Karma. I mean, I talk shit, but I feel like this Karma unit is actually kind of good. I don't really want to level, though. Do I want to hold Karma? Nah, that's fine. Like, surely I don't lose this, right? There's no way. And then I don't level here, and I'm gonna natural either a Malzahar or an Orianna. And do you see, like, the value that you get from buried treasures? Like, I'm up two components, so I just make Sunfire Zeke's. And then it, I'm, I'm just, like, I'm just, I just win for free. Like, the early game is too fucking strong. And then you play the strongest early game possible, and you just hit him with the fucking 4 one cent zero four one lottery. You hit, you hit, you don't hit, eighth. Whatever. But the thing is, it's not even eighth. If you don't hit, you go, like, top six. Because you 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 played a strong early game. Oh, my items are illegal. They're actually fucking illegal. Is that how you average a 5.4? Oh, I mean, I've been just trying to fucking play uncontested shit, but it's like, bro, it's contested for a reason. You just fucking join them. Y you play when it's not contested, like, nice, you're going fucking eighth. Like, if you try to play the comp that's not contested, you just go free eighth. Because, like, yeah, you might hit your board earlier, but the thing is, you're letting them hit their board earlier. And they're, they're, they're fucking playing a contested comp for a reason. Because it's just fucking broken. 5.4, bro, my Lux Azir is my only top four. Everything else, buff four. Like, I'm trying to fucking innovate, but I can't, man. Just play Kled, yeah. I mean, I can't wait to hit Swing 3, Teemo 3. Oh, wait. You fucking can't. My board is actually just too good. My items are also really good as well. Skill issue and blaming balancing. I, I have one game of Azir Lux today and I went third. Everything else bought for it. Like if you don't, there's four comps to play in the game if you don't high roll. I, what, I, I'm not even gonna bother saying it. Like uh, you don't even deserve the fucking knowledge. You suck. Like, just, just keep not playing Azir Lux. Like, more Azir Luxes for me, I'll fucking take it. Don't mind me. Please say I need to learn. Listen, there's two comps that you default. Azir Lux and Yasuo Kaisa. The reason is, is because AP items early game, and also they're like perfect duo carries, and also AP items early game are a lot stronger. So those are the two that you default. If you somehow have the best opener in the world with Ginsu DB, maybe you can play Aphelios. If you have Piltover before 2-2, two, two, 
then you can play Zeri. But if you do not have Piltover before 2 2 or a God Exodia opener with Ginsu DB, do not even bother playing Aphelios. You're going to go dead last. Guaranteed uncontested Giga Eighth. I'm sitting on Talia pair, Rek'Sai pair, Swain pair. It's a roll. I'm Teemo paired as well. Yeah, I just roll until I hit one or the other. Okay, but It's just worth too much. I'm just guaranteed to 5 streak. I'm fighting a... Uh, a Shiv GS is here. And now I just play this board and I 4 1 it. Actually, you know what? I probably actually go 0 every single turn until I hit one of these. Because the thing is, all three of them matter, and it's just too easy to hit. Guaranteed 8th? Dude, like, well, okay, sure. I might be guaranteeing your gold games. Sorry, everyone's just sitting there making 50 every single round. Bruiser plus one. Sword plus one also gives Swain. The spot I was never gonna 3-5 in anyway. You might as well just uh roll for spike when you can spike. And I can spike. This is my board. I'm 20 gold less than him, but I'm going to keep this streak, so I'm gonna I'm gonna make all my money back and I get to keep the fucking HP. But I think I'm going to play towards like Tempo into 8 Sork and 6 Sork. And because I'm playing a Tempo mid game, I'm not going to contest them for the lottery, but I'm saving so much HP mid game. And I'm just going to bleed out to a top 3. But I mean, top 3, that's pretty good. I'll allow it. I'm 4 Void. Gargoyle, Sunfire, Spark, Zeeks. I mean, it's Rek'Sai 2, Cho 2, so I can't really drop those. This is 4 Sork. He's 10 gold, he rolled a 10. What is he rolling for? Darius Katarina? Holy fuck, he turbo missed. I mean, hit Echo 2, I guess. And Z2. I mean, surely I don't lose this, yeah? Okay. How is Teemo reroll? You won't hit. It's impossible. There's always at least three of zero Lux players in the lobby. How the fuck are you hitting, hitting Teemo 3? You mean, like, I mean, yeah, I don't know. Three cost tear, I'll take it. Am I just carrying Velkaz? Like, reroll Velkaz? Four Sork? Velkaz carry? Ah, man, this is just not good. This is not good. Like, I could go Sejuani over Cho'Gath and play, like, Liss as well. 
And then I can just reroll this in Velkos. I can like I mean I, I kinda wanna play six orc though. But the thing is is like am I really expected to hit a Lux? Probably not. The entire lobby has fucking Lux 7 already. And I'm sitting here with nothing. Also, I'm probably gonna lose my streak here, but it's fine. I already got all the value that I needed. Level 640. If I didn't roll at all, I would have lost my streak, and not only that, I'd only be at 50 gold. Nice. So if I win around here, I keep my streak. Is, is he seven six Ionia? It's 10 gold. Six Ionia, three challenger. Nice. I think I cut my streak here. It's huge. Three item RE2 win con? Yeah, but it's hard to get there. It's, 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 not, it's, not, it's not worth playing for win. Like from this this spot, it's just a fucking <clears throat> tempo. Tempo into... I'm going to level roll next turn, and then I'm going to sack the stage, and then I'm going to 5 1 all in. And if I high roll on 4 1, and then I high roll on 4 2, I can play for win. But if I level and I don't high roll, I'm just going zero until my board is stable. And then I, I eight on four or on eight on five two or five five instead. But no matter what, I'm rolling until I feel like I'm I'm being chilling. Like either why like either that's going to be Velkos 2, Teemo 2 plus like some other shit, whether it's six Sork, whether it's Lux 2, maybe like a Zero Jarvin. Like whatever. I'm just zero every fucking turn. Who cares? This guy's an Ari. A 3 item Jin with an Ari. Oh, my streak is gone. Woohoo. He just giga hits the lottery. He has two Kaisas with 30 gold. Ari on 7. That's okay. It's fine. I'm joining the lottery next turn. I'm about to hit. Oh, Velcro too. What the fuck? I mean, I actually don't have to roll then. Like, after hitting the Velkos 2 here... I kind of do want to get 6 Orc, but I don't really want to roll just for Lux. But I don't really want to sack for Ari, because I don't even have Ari items anyway. I only have a tier right now. I have a Gargoyle, Sunfire, Spark. I got a Shoujin and a, a Golden Eco. What the fuck? Okay, I'm rolling for Shoujin. Right? I need a Tarek as well. I may be merciful, I'm 4 Void, 2 Bruiser. Like Sork plus 1. Like I can go Sona Jarvan eventually. I don't have to play Cho'Gath Rek'Sai. But for now they're upgraded so who cares. I'm not playing this this game. I saw one of these for now. Okay, I mean from this spot, I can actually play for win. I feel like I high rolled, and now I can actually play for win. Curse crown, fuck it. I mean, that's actually the. Oh, Jeweled Lotus? Well, I won the game then. It's a GG. Endless fucking hordes, yeah, alright, sure. Okay, I, I feel like I just lost all my front line. I'm fucking good. Oh wait, hold, hold, hold. I really want the Radiant item on this, but I can't justify playing it. I can't really justify playing it unless I hit Jarvan. Like, I'm not playing it with a fucking garbage ass Sona on my board.
Rosa's actually, yeah, but it's two star and it pairs with the uh, Cho'Gath too. Freeze everything with the prem. Why do you Shoujin lost the same fucking thing as Blue Buff? They buff Shoujin. Blue Buff is slightly better, but it uses two tiers. And you, you never have the luxury to use two tiers. It's uh, they buff Shojin, so it has uh, faster starting mana, and then it's it's 15 per auto, so it's three autos to cast after the first cast. But then they buffed it, so it's 30 starting mana, so it instantly casts already. So it's like that, like it's the biggest, like the tier, the tier items right now feel so good. Protectors out, Jarvan feels really good. Shojin on on every single unit in the fucking game feels good. I think it also they also buffed it, so it gives more AP as well. But it's, it's like the AP is whatever. They also buff JG, so like the rod, like the rod feels good like there as well. It's just too good. Like, I mean, it's like the biggest reason why this comp is just so strong. The early game is strong, and then the late game, you don't even fall off. It's... it's yeah. And like, blue buff, like, sure, like, blue buff is okay, but the problem with blue buff is it uses two tiers. But the thing is, in this comp, like, you, can, you basically can only use two BF swords, Shoujin and GS. And Shoujin, Shoujin lost, there's no fucking diff. There's actually just no diff. It doesn't fucking matter. Hey, Suo with bow, no one took. Belt, cloak. I'm just gonna level play team, I won't call it. It's gonna play bad, and it's okay. It's not that good. I don't really want to roll though is the thing. Like like uh, from this spot, with how hard I high rolled, I'm actually down to just play for play for first. I like look how hard I high rolled. I'm level eight making ten on four five. I don't have to roll a single time for the rest of the game. And then I level to nine, drop these these two shit units, and I just play around Ari, six sork Ari, Ari primary carry with some random bullshit in the back. Like it's actually like the spot's kinda good. Like, I can actually play for first this game. I got dropped a Golden Nico. And I hit Lux 2 in one millisecond. So to show it's show 2. This, this unit is a piece of shit. But I go 9 here, <clears throat> and I cap around 6 Sork, RE primary, or RE duo I guess, because it's probably still going to be Lux primary. Is there a Demacia that also, is there a Demacia that helps with RE as well, Sona? I mean, it would have to be Sona, but I'm not trying to play fucking Sona on my board. Am I just not playing Demacia then? I mean, and, and, and the thing is, it's actually kind of weird. The, uh... Shadow Isles Rise. This one doesn't feel that good. Like, if I play Shen. Shen, Karma, Ari with Tarek, like, that's fine. The problem is like, I need to find Shen. Like, where, like I can never do this Shen unit, man. How do you find Shen? You can't. It's fucking impossible. This fucker, like you literally can't find. You can't find Shen ever. I don't get it. I have Jewel Lotus 3. Like, I can go Ginsu Redemption, I can go Archangel. Archangel's really good on, uh... 
on Ari as or on Ari, then you know it's fine. Like I, I don't just want to make the items. There's no way I'm, I'm ending the game with fucking ZZ Rot, or not ZZ Rot. There's no way I'm ending the game with fucking Demacia in, because I have to play some shitter unit. I don't really like Archangel on Vertical Sork, but whatever. Items and items, of course. I just 9 on 6 1 this game. Wait, so what happens if you don't get the fawn option here? He didn't get the fawn? I just. Whoa! Oh. Okay. Man, I just sold my Azir. Fuck it. Ah, uh, you fucking suck. This Lux fucking sucks. I mean, it's fine. I, I'm definitely ending Shen Karma Ari. Like, there's no way I, I, I play this game without Shen Karma Ari. And then, like, as soon as I can, I'm going to start building towards... Oh, Azir. I also don't mind ending around uh, a random ass Senna. This unit's broken. But I don't know if I can this game, maybe. Nice. You see what fucking shit on my, my garbage unit. Oh fuck, this is- oh wait, my whole board's dead. The fuck happened to my team? What? Nice. I mean, top four all out. I don't think I can win this game though. But remember what I said? I'm playing a tempo comp. I'm not playing the contested shit. And it's just like, like Kaisa Yasuo, Kaisa Yasuo. Oh, Kaisa Yasuo. Woohoo! Fucking woke. Oh, this guy's Void Kaisa. My bad. My fault. I mean, I probably do play 8 Sork. Wait, if I play 8 Sork and I drop 1, 2... Oh wait, holy shit, wait, my board is about to be fucking... Wait, I actually won this game! Wait, this game's over! I won for free! How, how many open the... Uh... Wait, I just realized, can't people... Uh, can't these guys that got fawn, can't they die and then and then other people get double fawn? Or no? I think so, right? And I just don't see the fawn? So like someone could just have six fawns and the other person just has zero? Or, it, or it's like everyone gets the fawn. The offers are the same? Oh, wait, really? But then someone just chose not to get the pawn? The fuck? Now and forever. All right, let me figure it out. Okay, so I can drop Jarvan, Timo, Rek'Sai, Azir, so four slots, and I can play... I definitely want to play Orianna. I definitely want to play Orianna. Wait, Jarvan? Timo, Rek'Sai, Azir, and I can level. So I have five slots, but two of them are Sorks, so it's gonna be Orianna, that, and then it's Shen, Karma... Heimer. That's my board.
That's the board? I mean, I'm pretty sure that's, that's an instant win. Like, how the fuck am I supposed to lose? Oh, he's level 50 as well. Also, he has two RAs, Shiv, Protector's Vow. I'm just kind of good considering. Oh, nice. Now, I'm gonna just sack him one then, I just play for win out. I mean, there's no way I don't see a single RE. I'm just gonna open cell. Like, if, I, if I don't see a single RE, I don't even know what to say. That's just a book up there. I have to upgrade this for now, never mind, please. Like, do I even want to upgrade this shit? Probably. Sorkin. How much money am I at? Alright, and then hopefully I can hit another Protector another Spark. So I should just I should just kill off the uh, the karma immediately. My my Lux is instant dead. Hmm. Damn. My own yes. Woke. Oh, another sword plus one. I mean, it's basically a fawn. He just got a Zephyr. He just got a fucking Zephyr. Nice. I mean, this is basically a fawn, but it doesn't really do anything. I get to play this, I guess. Sure. Do I even want to upgrade the Karma? I kind of want the Karma to die ASAP. Like... Hopefully this is like, I have, like it doesn't just insta-kill me. Oh, it's insta-dead. That's not good for me. Why well, does he get away from the corner? Oh, I thought the, the Ari's tank here. Okay, if I win this fight, I win the game. 
Cause now I can just I can just knock one in. That's RC, fuck up, whatever. I'm over Jarvin. Zeke's. Alright, nice. GG. I got dropped a golden Nico on Wolves. I leveled to seven. I rolled twice. Lux? Rolled again? Lux. Nico Lux. Oh, um, and then I just go fast nine. Like, what the fuck? Nah. This game, nah, that's just unlock. I mean, it's not unlock, that's just too lucky. Like, the game's just all luck.